Hi guys. Can you guys see me? Right. Hi guys. Welcome to today's stream. Actually, people been at. Hello, Hong Yaman. Hello. Just to let you guys know, uh, welcome to today's Let's Talk. And why I'm actually doing this because I've been here trying to answer more of the FAQ that people trying to asking us all along what you want to ask. You can always comment here if you want to ask something about MSI laptops or maybe MSI themselves, you can always ask him here. But right now, uh, I'm here to actually answering some of the FAQ that people ask. What is the difference between the GE75, this one, the GE75, and the GE73, which is this one, the RGB one. A lot of people have been asking about that. What's the difference? Actually, the spec is the same. But if you do have any question, you can always just leave a comment in this live, and I will try to answer you as much. Uh, if you want to answer about this thing, then I will try to answer, answer you as much as possible. But right now, people have been asking, what's the difference? First of all, I will just slightly go through. First of all, the difference, main difference is the chassis, of course, you can see. It's totally different model when you look at it because the body is different, totally different. But nevertheless, both of it is still using an aluminium body. So it's still sturdy as hell. Now, and right now, the people ask, is the, is the specs the same? Yes, both of the specs is the same. Both also using at least RTX 2060, 9 gen, and i7 9 gen, sorry. Right now, the main difference, or well, you can see the very main difference, is the bezel, you can see. The monitor, right? Uh, let me on it so you can see properly. The monitor, thin bezel, and this one is not thin bezel. Right, you can see clear like this, right? One is thin, one is the usual frame, you can see the usual frame. But right, uh, and sp since we are speaking about the monitor, the monitor for the GE75 is actually 144Hz and the GE73 is 120 hertz. But why people say, why we need to have two radar, two radar and different model? Because we have a few preference, people, the, people like a lot of different things. Not, people, not all people like the Tim Bezel one. And some people might like the RGB one, as you can see. You see? It's shiny over here. Looks damn cool, right? Aside from that, the body sheet, the weight of it, actually if you compare directly right now, I just show you like this. I just already show you. The GE75 is slightly smaller than the GE73 because of the team bezel design. Which is why the GE75 is like maybe 100 gram, 100 gram, maybe 100 gram around there lighter than the GE73. MSI, yeah, hello. Hi bro, if you have any question you want to ask regarding stuff like your lap the laptop and stuff, you want what you want to know, you can always ask around here. And ask me, you are asking how much, which model are you asking? The GE75 or the GE73? Or are you asking for the GE73? Since you are just asking, I will... Ah, you are annoying. I will, I, will, I will put you to the side first. So I put you to the side. Right. For both of the machine, for 2060 version, is around... Eight to nine thousand around there, depending on the promotion. Right now, we have a Ramadan promotion going on right now. Actually, you can refer to that. But nevertheless, the GE seventy three is slightly cheaper than the GE seventy five. Both spec is the same. All right. Right now, we'll just go, just go back to one, one by one, showing off how, what's the difference. Just now, as we say, my laptop GS sixty three. Nice, bro. GS sixty three is actually good stuff. Nonetheless, go back to the now. After the best, the difference in the bezel, the only other <coughs> my bad, the only other different stuff is the body, which is at the bottom. You can see the design is different. This one is more to uh, ventilation, more to like uh, just ventilation holes and the rest. Uh, wait. Repeat the spec, please. All right, the spec for both machines right now, as you can see. Is still i7 9 gen RTX 2000 uh, 2060 uh, RTX is actually the same model they have the 2070 variation also it's actually the same 
or if you want to go for a GTX version, well, you still can go for it. But right now, I'm showing you right now is the actually the same spec. What I'm saying right now is what is the difference between the GE75 and the GE73? People be asking this a lot because it's the same spec. People are asking what's the difference besides the slightly cheaper price of the GE73. Ah, the difference is first of all the chassis, how it looks. Both also using aluminium, but it looks different. First of all, the GE75 is much more you can see elegant because they make it much more shinier. Actually, it's the same aluminium, just much more shinier and slightly smaller than the GE73. Don't be mistaken, both also 70 inch. Musaba, it's okay, bro. You can just ask anything you want. I just am answering you, answering most of the FAQ people may asking. Because I we receive a lot of questions asking what is the difference between them. So I've been trying to uh, explain some to let them know what is the difference because they never try. Good morning. Nevertheless, let us go back to here. The keyboard wise is actually the same. It's still using a Steel Series 3 keyboard. The RGB and the lighting is the same. It's the same. It's still the nice quality per key RGB keyboard. And the difference is the chassis. The team bed, the bezel, one is thick, one is normal. One is this one is one twenty hertz, and the GE seventy five is one four four hertz. All right, the main part, the main very main difference right now, I can say is the cooler booster five. All right, my graphic card in the laptop. Both laptop also using right now. What I'm showing right now, both also using twenty sixty RTX twenty sixty. Actually, this model also variant in twenty seventy. And maybe 2080 depend on the stock but right now what I'm showing you right now is 2060 both of it 2060 i7 9th gen all right the main difference for both of this both of this laptop the very main difference is the cooler boost the heat pipe usage the older version of means the G73 uh, is using seven heat pipe only and the newer one the GE75 is using eight heat pipe meaning that the GE75 for the cooler booster, the thermal control is slightly better than GE73. Alright, which is perfect model, GS, GE, GP, GL. Alright bro, let me just uh, explain to you the perfect one. Actually, there's no perfect both. All the uh, model you uh, listed out there is actually different category. Example, GL is more to, you can say, entry to mid-level. Yeah, depending on the spec, but it's more to entry to mid-level. And GP is more to and uh, more to moderate level, but it's not as good as GE. And the GE is considered the high spec, the highest spec one, and the best one, the overall best performance and overall everything. Voila, you can do anything with it. And the GS is literally a small, it's a thin version of the GE, but uh, well, thin. The more thinner, the more expensive. Yeah. So actually, if you want the best, of course, go for GT. It's a desktop replacement. That one is the best. GT. Uh, to be sadly, I cannot show you over here. If you have any like more, a lot of people asking about GT seventy six. Yeah, since I'm talking about GT, if you have interest to uh, want to have a look and want me to test out the GT seventy six for you, very soon because China is still coming to Malaysia. I cannot reveal the price yet. The GT seventy six is look yo, as is coming to Malaysia right now. It's coming at all. Since we are speaking about the GE, since we have a, GS, a GE 73 and a 75, right? We have a 65 coming in. Not exactly the same like this, but slightly different. It might have a, it have a 220, uh, 240, 240 hertz monitor. Those laptops already out now. Okay, right now, these two I'm showing you is actually it's in the market right now. It's already out. Right now, because I'm here just to show you what's the difference between the two of it. It has the same spec, also GE, but one is 73, one, one is 73 and one is 75. Actually, it's the same spec. The only difference is the heat pipe, which lasts inside, the size. Actually, the GE 73, this one on my left, or, or, on the screen is on your right, is slightly uh, lighter than the GE 73. Because why? The bezel, well, main thing is the bezel. You can see the thickness of the bezel right now you can see one is heavy one is very thick one is thin so this one is much more slightly uh, slightly smaller lighter 
But if people like to like tend to go heavier, because why? This one is much more sturdy to be honest, much more sturdy. You you don't need to worry about like getting a knock on it because this is tin. You might need to treat it more carefully. For this one, the G S N three is much more thicker, which where like, you can like just move around. You don't need to worry about the like you damage the bezel or anything. It's very sturdy. But the downside is it's heavier. Asin, hello there. If you have any question, feel free to ask over here inside the comment. I'll try to uh, answer as much as possible. Can I have one? Well, our shop is open today. You can go to have a look. If you're interested, you can you can always purchase one. Uh, right now, well, from here you can't have one. Hi. So my desktop has an MSI GPU, and when I use your overclocking software, clock won't overclock. All right, bro. Since you're doing overclocking, right? We using a GPU. Actually, can you actually like print screen your the spec and what the thing or take a picture of how you install to the Facebook? Because right now I can't really answer you because I don't know what uh, have you setting, what error have you like appear inside your monitor or it just doesn't show anything. Because we, I want to talk with you more Be on this screen. I cannot read really demo and see what's the problem you have right now. So or maybe you can just PM through Instagram with image and other stuff if possible. If not, you can always go to our Facebook page. You can PM there and I will reply you as soon as possible if I can if you PM me there. Uh, Alright. Back to here. One of the may another thing, the just now I'm not sure I managed to show you the interior right. I just keep on offing the laptop. Does MSI have trade in program? Uh, regretfully we don't have any trade in program right now. But if you do you can always like uh, consult our dealers, they might have a trade-in program depending on shops. When I overclock the clock, it doesn't do anything. Bro, do you install the the graphic card? Do you install GPU properly? Is, is it detecting the things? Or the, over, the overclocking core, did you manage to check the setting and everything on the BIOS? Alright, anyway, nevertheless, back to this. The keyboard, you can see, it's still RGP per key keyboard. Oh yes, you managed to set everything. Mm. Is it possible, bro, Jason? Is it possible you can print screen your the spec, your table of content, the like the overclocking software, everything? It just doesn't move. And, uh, and the GPU, what GPU are you using? The how you, like the placement of it, the BIOS setting. Is it possible that you can print screen one and PM us so we can see more? Then the screen in RGB looks good. Ah, to clarify, since you are speaking about the screen, both also running 100% sRGB. Means that the color accuracy is both accurate for these two models. The only thing different on the screen is one 44 hertz, 120 hertz. That's all. And the RGB. Yes, this RGB here on the, the shiny shiny part. Nevertheless, both screen is superb for gaming and design. This depending on which size you want. You can see both also 70 inch. Just a little bit thickness over here. Both also 70 inch. No doubt. The RGB keyboard is the same per key RGB. It's still running on Quota Booster 5. You can see the, the keyboard, everything over here is still per key RGB. It is the same. Also running on four exhaust over here. Two fan, four exhaust. Waiting for the GP75 coming Malaysia. Yes, you can wait for that. It's actually coming. And to answer you that, actually GP75 is using full aluminium and full in other design than the GE75. It's different. Look, kind of different. Too bad I cannot show you right now. Maybe next time. If uh, uh, some people are asking that, I will show you all next time. What we have. Alright. Right now, to have a look for the GE73, it's still the same keyboard. The same uh, Steel series per key RGB keyboard. This letter will be so good when playing Fortnite. Definitely, bro. Fortnite actually requirement is not that high. 2060 is considered overkill for Fortnite. Well, unless you want to enjoy some more, of course, it's good. But depending, overkill, definitely the GT. This one is more to overall performance. You want to play like Wolfenstein Anthem, maybe? Battlefield 5? This is the best, one of the best one. The fan, everything, alright. So since you since you are here, I can go in and test the keyboard for you, everything. Since both both of the functions is the same, I just use the GE75 and try. 
PUBG Mobile. Uh, PUBG. Yes, definitely PUBG. This is good. All right, I will show you. So I saw some people asking about the keyboard, right? All right. Keyboard, they say per key RGB keyboard. You actually can just one click and we change. Click and then it will change again and change. Actually, this key you can all change inside the SteelSeries keyboard app. It's inside. You can just change up to you and it can also configure to depend on the game. Once you like save like PUBG, it will like to a different like color. Depend on your setting. It's all depending on how you're gonna set it. It actually works both way. Either default, either you can set on your own. Love my GI is issue right now, gonna upgrade soon. Bro, what uh which model gonna upgrade? I can suggest you more. If you want to know, you can always ask here, I will tell you. When will the GP75 coming to Malaysia? Well I cannot be too exact to tell you when, but you can expect it's between this July? Latest August. You can expect it coming too. Coming. GE seventy six GE sixty five also coming. It's already on the way. Already on the way to Malaysia, but not check which office. And the GT seventy six, that Titan, that hell of this is coming. And I am eager to write showing you the the entire model. I can I I'm not sure touching myself. I only saw the picture. It's freaking huge. Nice beast. Alright. I most of it I only can show you that much. I I want to show you about the benchmark because but it might run on oh yeah I can I can test it out the speaker right now here for you. Since I have installed the Final Fantasy benchmark inside there, might as well I just show you all how it works. Alright, let's see. Final Fantasy 15 benchmark. I just show you the benchmark, it's the same. Alright, let me go high quality. 4K display. Should I go 4K? Nah, I just go uh because this one 4K a bit overkill, never mind, I go for full HD, full screen, let's see. By the way, this two laptop also running on the very good speaker, which is the giant speaker with woofer. Very big size, two speaker and two subwoofer. Let's see. Right now, on full screen, on blast, right now I can let you see, this is the benchmark right now. Although it might look sucks through the camera, but I'm just showing you really how it works. Alright, it's still loading. Let's see, let me increase the volume. Alright, it's still loading. Oh yeah, right now I'm not plugging in any... I'm not plugging into a power source in my leg. Hold on, I, I plug in right now. Alright, let's see, plug in. No when, when wonder I feel it's slightly slower. Is the sweater stuff only? <laughs> yeah, well, if you stay tuned with us, we might have a giveaway for the for the sweater. If you if you are the lucky person, you might win one. Well, not actually only for stuff. Depending. All right, here You're we good. go. Oh, oh. You're okay. good. Look at the sound. You're Sorry. good. Oh my god. Too loud. Too loud. And stop. Look at the sound, man. I'm not even max everything. It just blasts through the entire room. See you around. All right. As it for run, you can see the color. Everything is smooth. The fan is still running. The fan is still very quiet right now. I can see the fan. I can on the I can on the Dragon Center for you to check what is the fan and what is the performance and what is the heat later. Right now, I just let it run over here. Nah, the sound. See the sound. Just, just listen to the sound. People be asking what is the quality of the sound, and they never actually went to the shop and tried. Right now, you can listen to the sound. Alright, the sound is actually coming from the bottom over here. Here. Two big speakers over here. Very two one over here, and two woofer over here. So you can listen to the sound coming from here. So actually, when you put it on the table, the sound is much more better because of the design, the, the sound coming from the below. Now, you can, you can hear right the sound. It's looking nice, right? Even I also like this laptop a lot. I don't want even to uh, use my headphone. Because of the sound, it's so good. It's still... Oh, by the way, the sound is using Dyna audio and high res audio. That's why the sound it can be so good. The monitor-wise, you can see the color. Although it's through, it's through the webcam, you can see the, the, the color, everything. It's IPS, by the way. Easy now. That's why you can see. You can even go, go slant and you can see everything. It's IPS level. 
to very fine. This is actually a TN panel. Oh my god, so Yes, of course, our laptop comes in with Nahimic. It's Nahimic, Nahimic 3. Both laptops also Nahimic 3. As long as it's a newer version, it will go with Nahimic 3. Alright, I go slightly lower a bit. Just uh, what I was saying. Can this laptop be used for serving or encoding bird stream, live stream? Of course. Actually, to be honest, to tell you, there's a lot, there's a few live stream going on Facebook. Actually, I've been using this model to do like to do live stream. Yes, no joke. I'm actually using this, this to do live stream. Actually, for live streaming, what requirement you need is to have a fast CPU, a good encoder, which is the GPU, and you have a good RAM and the cool and the cooling system to go because it. A lot of performance when you're doing live stream. Last time I've been doing live with Battlefield 5. Battlefield 5 live, Top G live, and live on a 1080p with this laptop is still going nice. It's still suit. Uh, the only thing bad is the internet here, lah. You know, Malaysia, Uni 5. You know, lah, the internet. Well, streaming wise, it's good. Okay, wait. What model is this? The one I'm showing you right now is the GE75. The GE75 9 SE or SF, depending on the spec you want. There's a lot of spec out there for this model actually. Oh, oh, oh there you go, there you go, there you go. That you run. There's few spec in this market right now for the GE75. There's come with 2060 version, 2070 version, i7 8 gen or i7 9 gen, depending on this. Depending on the stock. But right now, the most of the stock right now we have and the best selling one is of course the 9 gen one. Why? Because of 9 gen and RTX, because to sell someone asks, is it good for encoding? Besides live streaming, actually if you are a gamer and a designer, a content creator, actually we also recommend you can go for this model because of the, the monitor quality you can see, the color, everything smooth, lighter, the battery can last at least 5 to 6 hours for content creating. I'm not gaming yet, not gaming yet. And the keyboard, everything, and the I try to uh, render my video, render some uh, Photoshop image. It actually much more faster. Well, depending if you want to go hardcore, you want to go hardcore rendering. You can go for P series or P three series, which are cater for designers or maybe workstation. This one is more to gaming, but still you can use for content creation and such because of the image quality and everything, the speed. Well, if you want to edit for some, uh, you are DJ. This is also good because of the sound. Right, let's see, let it continue to run. Because I'm streaming Counter Strike and I use Intel Quick Sync for encoding and the GPU and CPU rendering the game. Ooh, you, you stream like that. Uh, well, actually, to be best, to say to help the computer and help your streaming, we actually suggest you to use GPU to render the game and CPU to do streaming. That's considered one of the best settings. Depending, yeah, subjective, yeah, very subjective, yeah. Depending on your laptop and depending on your game setting. Because right now I'm unsure what is your game setting for CSGO. Maybe the, uh, you lower down the resolution and such. But from what I do last time, the best setting I can have is using either one. Like uh, most of it, I use GPU for rendering the game, for live streaming the game. Means I doing encoding for the game, and CPU is doing for the live stream setting. Means that everything you run through the CPU. Then, after that, the GPU will render the game through the life. Depending on your setting, but, and depending on laptop, depending on your machine. But for this machine, I usually go for that one because it's the best and it will be very smooth. Unless your internet sucks. One, that's one of the main problems. Huh? Nevertheless, if you say internet sucks, this one is actually built in with a killer net. What is killer net? Which is, uh, uh, how should I explain this? It's actually a uh, hardware. That can actually help you regulate your internet. Either internet or internet. It's regulate. Example, you want to, like, you are running a few, you are playing CS, CSGO. CSGO is an online game. You need to run in, internet together and live stream. So you can set a, uh, you can set a number of speed you want to cater for the program. It's depending on you. But both of these machines also have this program. If you, uh, right now I cannot try to you because I, I'm not connected to a LAN. So it's myself. Gigabyte or, gig or 10 gigabit network. Gigabit or 10 gigabit network. Wait, uh, sorry bro. Which network you are referring to? You mean the card or you mean the... Hold on, Send a request to your live video. 
Right, let's see. Let's, sorry, yeah? Bro, uh, before you answer me, I let, me, let me check. Want to bring your live video? Oh, you're in the live with me, JX8457. Well, maybe next time. Because right now, uh, I can't live together, or maybe you want, you, or you want to have something to say to me. You can always comment over here. I will talk to you. And a lot of people joining and waving at me. All right. Oh, I, I pressed, I, I went for a restart. I, I missed out the, I miss, I missed out the mark just now. Oh my god. Never mind. Let it run again. Let it run again. I want to check the, I want to check the score because some people say the score. What is the score? What is the score? Ah, uh, the cut on, the cut on the laptop. For this one, if you are, uh, the killer internet is actually E two five thousand. Depending, yeah, depending, yeah, very subjective. But this card, uh, if you wish to know more, I will check for you more because right now I cannot open everything yet. And the uh, card, to be exact, I will answer you through Facebook or maybe through Instagram. I will PM you so I remember your name, Ashin One. All right, after I check on Monday, I will get back to you to let you know more for the card because right now, too, there's too many going on right now. I cannot reset for you. All right, since I'm still running benchmark on this one, this one resolution I just set. Too bad I only managed to install one of the benchmark inside one computer. But still, both also running sRGB 100%, depending, depending on what you want to set. Alright, Ashin, I will. Wait, let me save your name down. Then I reply you on Monday so we can know. Alright, let. Actually, bro, since I'm still running this, you, any one of you have still have any question you, or you want me to repeat again what I just said? You can always feel free to comment. As since you're just running on this again, again. So sorry, bro. I miss out the I miss out the marking just now, and it just go repeat. I thought it should be just stop halfway, but it just go repeat. Or uh, if you still have any question, you can ask ask me right now. I will answer you. Oh, and someone still requests to be in my live video. Should I accept you, bro? You want to be in my live video? Never mind, never mind, bro. I. Uh, never mind, let's see, chat. Tay Singh uh, Sorry, I cannot pronounce the name. Now let's do it. Never mind. Put it back here to let you enjoy. Or any one of you still have anything to ask before? Can you check out your GT74. What? GT7402 GB SSR? GT's Oh, just now you're the one who asking for the overclocking, right? GT74 or oh, DDR5 I use it, the core can't overclock mm, Well, as I just answered just now, some person also cannot overclock I really need you to like, screenshot your setting, everything Because right now, I can't really determine I got no problem doing the overclock on my PC as well I got no problem on that But I just want you, you to like, take a screenshot, everything to post it to us or maybe like you can PM us with the screenshot and everything so we can like determine what is the problem that what what setting have gone wrong or maybe the installation. Alright check my PM. Sure bro but right now I cannot I cannot see my PM. Nevertheless after I done with this I will check your PM reply you. Do not worry bro I will answer you to that. But if you still have any other question or maybe regarding this uh regarding the newer laptop or this current laptop or the older laptop or what you have you want to ask, you can always ask me right now. Beside the GPU overclocking, the GPU overclocking, I will answer you very soon. Do you have any more questions regarding this? Actually, it's been all too bad I cannot talk anymore. That's why you can see I'm a bit fast because the Instagram live cannot go too, cannot, cannot go too soon. Or actually, I want to stream, live streaming the game, hard testing the game. But too bad Instagram doesn't let me to do that. Currently, maybe soon, I can do that soon with some setting or with more gears, I can do that. But right now, I only can, I only can show you the, the basic performance, the basic overall, everything. Right now, you can see the benchmark is running twice already. And you can see the fan is still very... Ah, just let it go. I'll go for the... The Dragon Center. Just some people have been asking. The Dragon Center. Let's see. Dragon Center checking the. There you go. Alright, the spec. So, okay, the number, the number. Alright, show you the number. 6905. 
6,905. Last time I done the same benchmark, it's actually the conceal very high. Alright. And then you see. You can see right now the benchmark is still running. I on I on the uh, dragon center. Actually the dragon center the usage is something like the or MSI after burner. It can do overclocking on your laptop too and monitor everything you go. Right now, you can see the usage for GPU is max. Of course, I go everything. And the temperature is right now only at 75 degrees. I didn't even on my cooler boost yet. I didn't on the cooler boost yet. It's still running on high quality for the game, the benchmarking. I on high quality on 1080p. It's running at 75 degrees only. I didn't even on the cooler boost. That I, right now, I on the cooler boost. Well, it becomes slightly noisy. Well, of course, the fan. This game's too heavy to play. Bro, get one, then you can play. Get one and you can play. Well, after I on the cooler boost, it's slightly noisier. True. You want to have, you want to, you want the fan to blow stronger, right? Of course, you need to produce some sound. I, I don't blame that. But, well, it can be slightly annoying. But unless you, if, if you're wearing your headphone, you don't, you, you don't feel much. Right now, I on the cooler boost. Right now it's dropping to 73, it's still dropping, but nevertheless, you can monitor everything over here. CPU, GPU, you can set, right now uh, you can set everything over here, cooler boost, sport mode, 100%, full screen, whatever, whatever so you can set. Alright, I cannot even control my mouse over here. Okay, what is the graphic card? Right now actually I'm using a 2060 graphic card only, the 2060, not 2070, yeah? 2060, I can even run this game on high, nearly max. And still, the FPS is smooth and only at 70, 70 something degree. I'm still running it. Alright, I'm off the cooler boost, it's quite noisy. Camper! Eh? Eh, don't, don't, please don't mention my name. My, my, my. It's constantly my name, but please don't, don't, don't mention it here. I want to stay anonymous for my name so people can guess what's my name next time, but. Ah, screw you. Now that's okay. If you want to set your keyboard, still serious keyboard, everything is still workable in this is this program. You can set everything, monitor everything, run everything over here. Even the USB light, this one, the red light over here, you can off it over there too. So that's why I say this software can control everything you want. And right now I don't have much time on Instagram Live already, so I just wish to ask. What other answer? What un, what other question you want to ask so I can answer you right now? If not, I will answer you next time. Maybe I will answer you next time. You have a life again. If I get the more question, and I, I will try to answer you. But nevertheless, next time will be GE sixty five and GT seventy six. I will showcase that both model through life. Nice feature to have a USB light. Yes, during the night or why we do that? People ask is is. It's a waste. Why, why we need to have a light on the USB? Why? Because you can't even find the USB jack. Every time I want to plug it in, where is the USB? Eh? Where got USB? You need to look at the left, you need to look at the right. But right now, you have the light. Oh, there's one. Plug it in. Done. Ah, people never know why we need to have a light. That's, re that's the main reason. Uh, people ask, is that increase the cost? No. It's the same. Colorful, definitely. Why, 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 people say, why, why lighting? Why RGB? Why RGB? Why lighting? Everything lighting. Does it look nice? It looks nice. Nevertheless, <laughs> any RGB freak over here? Any RGB freak? Right, you want anything RGB? Everything flash RGB? RGB here, RGB here. You want to install one more RGB over here? Flang everything. Is there any, any hardcore maniac over here? RGB maniac. If you, if anyone of here is an RGB maniac, we can have a good talk. I also like RGBs actually. Everything shine. Too bad the USB port is not RGB. <laughs> I've been asking too much for that one. Well, I can maybe I can customize on my own, but nah, this is laptop. I will not cust I will not do that. All right, bro. If uh, maybe I have one more minute to see if anyone of you want to ask anything else. If no, I think I'll be ending the stream over here because. I can see the Instagram live is going to end maybe soon because of the time I've been streaming for more than 30 minutes already. I just worry that it might automatically close, close down. Are you guys doing a mic? Making one? Mm. 
I can't answer you on that yet. I only can say, well, mic wise, I cannot really promise you. I can I cannot really say that we might have a mic, but we do have mouse, gaming keyboard and stuff. Cherry key. Uh, I did prepare it so I can show you the the things. The favorite we have is the keyboard headset, RGB headset. Really nice. Uh, next time I I really cannot really demo you how nice is the headset everything. Thanks for like service, no problem. I will un if you have any more questions, you can just always comment in our post or PM me. I will try to answer you again next time. Nevertheless, mic we do not have yet, but you can always use our headphone, the headphone. We include a mic. That one is actually uh, I will not comment too much on the mic, but the quality of the heads, the headset is really nice. Too bad I didn't prepare one right now. It's actually called the GH70. GH70. If you have a chance, you can always look up to it and see what is the GH70 or maybe a GH60. Depending on the RGB. Oh, I'm running again. Let me, let me, let me just close it. Oh my god. Okay, there you go. If, too bad we don't have that. And other peripheral like monitors, uh, a phone holder we do have, yeah, or something like that. Or something like this. It's, it's not peripheral, it's just a little things. We do have all other stuff like mouse pad, uh, heavy mouse, or gaming mouse, FPS mouse, even like more, those MMORPG mouse. Depending, depending on what you need. But for my... The currently we don't have yet. For future wise, I cannot comment on that. Or maybe you still have any question. If you don't have, I'll be ending this live stream right now. I give you ten more seconds to answer the question. Do you have any more question? Or do you have any question to Lucky? Or do you have any question to this big Lucky behind me? Or you have any more question? If you're not, oh yeah, disclaimer: you cannot bring this to home. It's mine. Mm -hmm. You cannot bring this to home. It's mine. It's follow me home, alright? Why your name is Taki? Uh, <laughs> uh, why his name is Taki, alright? <laughs> ask, his, ask his parent. Ask his parent. His parent is the one who gave him the lucky name. But, wait, we can't, there's no meaning to the name. It's just lucky. I need help on one of your product. I have a PM now. MSI I key. All right, you you, I I will answer you through that PM. All right, I will luck. Uh, ah, PM MSI lucky. Thanks for giving emotional. I've already have. Don't worry, bro. If you have still any other question, you can feel free to comment over here. I just worry that Instagram life might stop suddenly because he's very lucky. <laughs> Yes, he is very lucky. When I play any kacha game or just bring to do anything, I need to have some luck. I always bring him. It's red, Chinese. Red is lucky and his name is lucky. It's double the luck, double the fun and I have a bigger one behind me. Big luck, small luck. And smaller luck and much more smaller luck like this one. Much smaller luck like this one. Cute, right? Very little, cute, little, small, lucky keychain. Like. Nevertheless, oh well, if you want to have this keychain, mm, can do a giveaway right now. Alright, who won it? Tell me, who won it? I will give it to him. Uh, although it's in packaging, I don't want to ruin the packaging and everything because I might send it out. Who wants to have a little keychain? A lucky keychain right now? You do? You want? Alright bro, I'll, I'll just give it to you, no problem. Since you, since you went, went here to talk with me, I'm, I'm, also happy with, I'm also happy with talking with you. I enjoy talking with people. Alright, I, I, I'll give it to you. You just, P, since you PM me already, right? Just PM me your, like, your full name, your house detail, everything, I'll send it to you. It's a keychain. A, a small lucky for good luck. Oh, life, life for long. You also want it. You like, you want, do you want, which one? This one? That one? Nah, I'm joking, this one cannot, cannot give. Well, too bad, I only have one right now. I only have one. I only have one. Wow, why why suddenly got so many people want the the lucky? Mm, all right, all right. Never mind. Right now I only have one. I give to Ashini for this time. Do not worry, Jason. Do not worry, Life Gong. I will also prepare more next time. I prepare more. Then I can send. It to, I can like do a little giveaway for all you guys. Since you guys been talking with me, I also like a lollipop. MSI have no lollipop, please. <laughs> I got no lollipop. Alright. Alright, you wanna get lucky. 
No problem. You just send in with us. Next time, we have our live very soon. Maybe July, mid of July, around there. We have another one. Since I will showcase the GE65 and the GT75, I will showcase that one. Then I will do a giveaway for this. Uh, PK Log, sadly, I only have one. I only have one, and first come, first serve, I give it to uh, someone already. Now, never mind, I will give it to you again. I will, I will do another live next time. Dude, I accidentally wrote it. <laughs> no problem, bro. Never mind. Next time, I will do more. I will prepare more lucky. I prepare more things, and I will, give it, I will do a giveaway next time on our live, and I will showcase GC76 or GE65. By the way, just I, right, now, right now, I will be asking you one question. I will ask you one question. Actually, do you guys know about like eSport, how eSport grow or how eSport uh, work, working? Ma. No problem, no problem. Don't worry, I, re I reserve your name, BKB. BK Lord and Yiban, I reserve one for you next time. You just join our show next time, I will, I will give it to you. I will give it to you, it's a promise. Looking forward, definitely. By the way, tomorrow, today, uh, uh, today is Saturday, right? Okay, tomorrow we have, we actually going to be on TV. We are going to be on TV on Discovery Channel. Mm -hmm. Tomorrow, 9 o'clock, we will be on Discovery Channel. I repeat again. Tomorrow, 9 o'clock, MSI will be on Discovery Channel talking about the growth, the, like, the, how eSports started and how MSI like, with the eSports and everything. Because eSports, no one knows what happened with eSports. It's just saying, oh, it's an eSport. But you never know the history of it. So you can always join us. You can watch on Discovery Channel on MSI on Discovery Channel. You guys doing any sport? Yes, of course. We are doing it right now. We well locally, we not sure. How, we still organizing maybe for overseas CS. Yeah, oh CS. If for Counter Strike, we have, we have for Counter Strike, we have. Actually, we are partner with the Time Excellence. We are having a like. Esports tournament for CSGO, actually, yes. But not, uh, very soon, very soon. It will announce. Nonetheless, if you mean we have any other tournament like going on worldwide, of course we have the MGA Cup, means that the MSI Cup, we have it. Overwatch? Oh. Hi, all. Hi, all. Overwatch? Maybe? Depending? See? I... I cannot, I can for the event stuff, the one not yet decided, I cannot really tell you. But for a CSGO one, I can... Apex? Sure, 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 sure. We, I will let you guys know if we have any more other tournaments. But right now, what I can say is, what we have is like... Mm, the MGA, the MGA Cup, although it's not locally. The local one we have with Taiwan Excellence, the upcoming event. We shall have CSGO inside. We will, announce, we will let you guys know more. We will let you guys know more very soon. Apex, everything, of course we have. MSI, well, one of the gaming eSports, we like eSports. Look, look at this, eSports, eSports. I'm actually a player, you know. I'll be my dream to play on stage. Wow. Bro, don't worry, it will come true. It will come true. You will join a CSGO tournament very soon. Alright. I think that's for that. If, do you have any more questions before I end this? Do you have any more questions? For event-wise, I cannot really tell you any more than that because not not your design. Apex Legend, I can say soon. I can say it's soon. But I cannot tell you what. I cannot tell you. Maybe soon. Very soon. This is soon. Well, event-wise, if I let you guys know too early, well, there's some a bit problem here and there. Nonetheless, it will be very soon. Like seriously though, true, I'm serious. CSGO tournament, we do have one. We will have one. We, although it's not by us alone, we have other partners with them. Partner don't, don't let, but who cares? It's my dream. It's a good dream, bro. But you need to talk with your parents. I, I myself is actually uh, also a tournament player for previously for Dragoness, for Bread and Soul. Uh, it's MMO, RPG, and World Warcraft. I'm actually also a player for Overwatch also. Well, I can, I can dare say, you must talk with your parents, bro. Talk with them. Let them know how good is eSports. If they don't know how good is eSports, stay tuned to tomorrow's... <laughs> I'm very hard sale right now. If your parents do not know what is the good of eSports, what happened in eSports, what is the evolution right now eSports can give, what is the like market value right now, check with us at Discovery Channel. Make them watch it at 9pm tomorrow. 9pm, make them watch 
the channel, we will talk about the eSport and stuff. Make them understand what is the eSport and let you to join. That's why. Right now, I'm giving a reason to watch the Discovery channel. Tomorrow, 9pm, talk to them. Make them watch the channel. Let's say, just let you understand what is the eSport. Mm, there you go. So you can ask your parents to watch Discovery channel to let them know what's the eSport. So you can convince them to go tournament. Don't worry, bro. I can show after you, they watch that, they will let you go. I am very sure. Alright, that's all that. Do you have any more other questions? Any more other questions? If no, I'll be end today and see you next time. See you guys next time, if that's so. Alright, by the way, Ashin, I'll be sending you this here. Ciao. I'm an MSI fan. Yeah, so do we. Alright, thanks. Thanks for joining us. See you guys. Bye bye. New tapas.